Isn't it quite frustrating when you order something and your product doesn't work? I want to talk about this Wi-Fi card DVR that I've ordered and that never worked for me. And I want to explain how I was able to resolve. I've checked all over Google, internet, YouTube and everywhere and I could not find a res resolution. However, I was able to find simple tech reviews channel and uh, he was able to suggest something that I've already tried like think, resetting the uh, 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 resetting the DVR. So this DVR doesn't come up, uh, come with a battery. That's what they claim that they don't. It doesn't come with a battery and it directly works with your car battery. So I tried doing it's a hard frustrated. So finally, I was able to resolve this and you want to know how? Check out my video. So here is the deep car DVR uh, that I've received and it's uh, it goes behind the mirror. I'm not going to explain much about about the functionality of this DVR. If you want to see you can check out a simple tech reviews channel. I'll provide the link uh, in the description. You can check out his channel how these uh, DVR works. It's almost one and the same for any kind of uh, manufacturers that you have received this DVR from. So basically my DVR com uh, came uh, with a car a charger or the cigarette light charger uh, and uh, I, I connected this one uh, to my car and I was unable to get, uh, get, get it to work. So how I was able to get it to work, first thing I just want to uh, provide a quick feedback about this product. This is a 3M uh, tape but it really it doesn't hold so good. I just, I just, you know, I just pulled it and it just came off right there. Anyway, so slide it back and this the piece, the camera will come off and this is supposed to stick to the uh, windshield and for me it just came off when I pulled it off. Anyway, all right, so here is a, here is a car Wi-Fi uh, car DVR and, uh, and here is a screw right here. There's only one screw, a uh, tiny one and just un when I removed it and then there are two clips over here. You put the sharp object or a screwdriver just to remove it. I've already removed it so I'm just going to show it how I was able to fix the problem. So after you know, uh, after inserting a screwdriver into two holes, in these two holes, and uh, I was, uh, un, you know, there are clips. I removed these clips, and then this piece came off. So uh, to my surprise, I was able to find this battery attached, 3.7 volt, 500 mAh battery that was connected. So what I've done is I've just. Uh, there's, there's one of the cables it was uh, it was connected here in the circuit at uh, the negative uh, charge and I've just snapped it off and after removing this I have isolated it so that it doesn't uh, touch anywhere all right so here is the close-up so basically this uh, negative uh, charge uh, from the battery the 500 mAh 3.7 volt battery was connected here where it says uh, B negative. So after removing that, I was able to uh, reset the car DVR and uh, my Wi-Fi was able to connect to my phone. And uh, I'm going to share a short video uh, to show how the, uh, how, uh, the video or the clarity of the Wi-Fi DVR is. And uh, if you like the video, please give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to my channel thank you so much and this is tony signing off so as you can see the camera is here nicely secured but only thing is i'm kind of afraid that the 3m tape will come out otherwise it's uh you know otherwise it's fine it should be working now so let me go ahead and connect it let's see and here i plug my car is already on I plug the cigarette lighter charger and here it is and I connect it let me see if the light is glowing yeah there I can see the blue light for Wi-Fi and red light is for the camera
All right. So that's my DVR. So thank you so much for watching this video. Please ensure that you subscribe to the channel. Thank you once again.